The iPad keyboard dock has 13 keys at the top of the keyboard for controlling special functions on the iPad. Pressing the home button returns the iPad to the home screen which contains your applications. Pressing the search button displays the spotlight search field which allows you to search for just about anything including pictures, music, and messages. The next two buttons allow setting the brightness on the iPad. The left button decreases the brightness while the right button increases the screen's brightness. Pressing the photos button displays your photos in picture frame mode on your iPad. Pressing the keyboard button either displays or hides the on-screen keyboard. The next three buttons allow you to control songs, movies, images, and slides. The left is the rewind button, the middle is the play or pause, and the right button is fast forward. The next three buttons allow you to control the sound coming from your iPad speaker or headphone port. The left button mutes the sound, the middle button decreases the sound, and the right button increases the sound volume coming from your iPad speaker or from headphones connected to the iPad headphone port. Finally, there's the lock button. When you press the lock button, the iPad is locked so that nothing happens if you touch the screen. On the back of the iPad and keyboard dock, you'll find two ports. The first is the line out port, which allows you to connect external speakers or headphones. You'll also note the dock connector port, which allows you to charge your iPad or to sync the iPad 